All right. <clears throat> so, what I want to talk about today is, I guess, just therapy. Um, the reason why I'm talking about it is because I'm in a parking lot that I used to, I used to. I used to go to therapy, I used to have therapy sessions like, I think it was like for two months, this was months ago, I can't even remember how many months ago it was, but I would always come and just park my car, because it was over the phone, so I would come over here, park my car, and then just talk to her for, I think it was like an hour or whatever, I had like hour sessions, and when I pulled in, I was like, damn, I should probably talk about that. Um, first, because I know therapy, there's a huge stigma behind it, it's for crazy people, blah, 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 look, bro. Therapy is not for crazy people. <laughs> I think crazy people are the ones that know they need to go to therapy and don't do it. I think those are the actual crazy people. Now, me, I'm actually, as, as far as I know, well, not even as far as I know, in my family, like, I'm the first person to go to therapy. And I had been wanting to go for a little while before that, but, you know, some things happened around that time, and then I was just, it just kind of, made me realize that now was the time for me to do it and I won't go into detail about any of the things that um, made me want to do it I mean it really doesn't even matter anymore but um, it was one of the best decisions I ever made real talk because there's only so much you can do by yourself and sometimes you don't want to talk you know what I'm saying to the people that are around you you know sometimes you just want to talk to a complete stranger you know so that's what I did and like I said I did that for like two months and it was cool. It uh, it definitely helped. It definitely worked. I'm not saying that I'm fixed and I'm all good now. Like I'm not saying that at all. But I would definitely uh, do it again. And I actually used uh, BetterHelp. Like you know the the they got ads for it all the time on YouTube and stuff like that. This video is not sponsored or nothing like that. I'm just talking about what I used. <laughs> um, but yeah, my therapist was real cool and. You know, the funny thing about it is, like, when like when I realized when I was getting to the point where I was just like, okay, I'm starting to feel like I don't need to talk to my therapist anymore. Like, I had a session coming up already, and so when that session came, you know, I was trying to figure out a way to let her know that, you know, I didn't feel like I needed her anymore. And I was kind of nervous because I really didn't know how to say it or word it, and she pretty much beat me to it like she was just like well it seems like you know all the goals that you had because you have to fill out like a form or whatever to figure out where you at and what's bothering you and stuff like that she was like well you pretty much you know accomplished all your your, your goals that you have for therapy so she was like do you feel like you need me anymore and I was like damn <laughs> it's crazy the way that shit worked out but anyway um I think it's definitely worth it to go to therapy if you feel like you need to. Um, Cause I feel like everybody needs it to some degree. And one of the main reasons why I feel like everybody needs it is because everybody has had something happen to them when they were a kid. I'm not talking about no weird shit or nothing like that, but it's just like, when you're a kid, you're unconscious and things that aren't okay or aren't normal become normal to you and you grow up thinking that it's fine you know in some way shape or form and you don't realize how it can affect you later in life so I think that's one of the main reasons why everybody should go to therapy and even then you don't have to just straight up go to therapy like I went because of how much it was bothering me but you know you can do a lot of other things that are therapeutic like whether it be journaling that's something I do I write a lot uh, or just talking to people that actually understand where you're coming from like understand what you're feeling and stuff like that like talking is therapeutic for me as well that's another reason why i do these videos and stuff like that because honestly no matter what i'm talking about getting it out and getting it on camera or whatever more so just getting it out that that helps me a lot because it's like a sense of relief it's like it's not whatever idea i had in my head is not in my head anymore i let it out whether it be in writing or you know what i'm saying using my voice and then it's less going on in here. So definitely figure out what, what, what is therapeutic for you or, or 
relieving for you like figure out whatever that is like like i said for me it's just journaling speaking talking to the right people the gym sometimes you know what i'm saying like whatever it is for you just try to figure that out and if you can't figure something out man don't be afraid to go to therapy bro especially i mean because look at me dude like i'm i'm a man and i'm a black man at that going to therapy already has a stigma especially as a man especially as a fucking black man because in the black community we don't do fucking therapy and it shouldn't be like that because to be real we we some of the most i mean i can say because i am black like we some of the most fucked up people in the world you know what i'm saying straight up that's just the way that i look at it like we some of the most we got some of the most like traumatic experiences and stuff like that you know that we just deal with that we just hold on to for for so long and it's just like it's just draining us slowly so yeah man if you're thinking about going to therapy like if you've been thinking about it for a few months few years or whatever i say do it you know what i'm saying at the very least i would say download the better help app and just fill out the little form you can fill out the form for free and they don't charge you nothing just fill out the form just so you can get an idea of what you want to work on even if you don't book a session just just fill the shit out and just see if you figure out something new you know what i'm saying i feel like that'll help at the very least but uh yeah man don't be afraid to go to therapy don't be afraid to be vulnerable like it's it's there's a lot of strength that comes with vulnerability you know what i'm saying like don't look at it as as a bad thing or, or especially as a man don't look at it as being weak hell no holding on to pain and, and having issues and not saying nothing about it to me that's weak voicing what you think and feel and how you feel will take you a lot farther in life than holding on to what you think and feel you know what i'm saying so uh yeah that's all i got man y'all take it easy i'm gonna catch y'all on the next one I'm about to cut this camera off because it's hot as hell out here peace